Yellowstone Park Pool Eruption Caught on Camera A major eruption at Yellowstone National Park that occurred over the weekend was captured on video by a newly installed webcam. The eruption occurred Saturday night at Black Diamond Pool in Biscuit Basin, according to the United States Geological Survey. On May 14, a new webcam was installed at Biscuit Basin to track activity at Black Diamond Pool, the site of a hydrothermal eruption last summer, the agency wrote in an update from the park's Volcano Observatory. Hydrothermal eruptions occur when water suddenly turns to steam underground. In July 2024, a much larger explosion at the pool sent debris flying hundreds of feet into the air and damaged a boardwalk used by park visitors. Biscuit Basin was closed for the remainder of the summer. According to the USGS, there is monitoring data and eyewitness accounts that indicate there have been sporadic eruptions at Black Diamond Pool several times since last year's explosion. Officials say hydrothermal vents typically occur in the park one to several times per year, but they often occur in remote areas, where they may not be immediately detectable. A similar but smaller vent occurred at Porkchop Geyser in 1989. Yellowstone caldera activity remains at background levels, with 119 earthquakes detected in May, largest equals M2.7. measurements show little subsidence of the caldera since early October. On May 31st at 8.39 p.m. Mountain Daylight Saving Time, a small eruption occurred at Black Diamond Pool in Biscuit Basin, the site of last summer's hydrothermal vent. The event was recorded by a new webcam installed in early May. There has been little activity at Steamboat Geyser since its last eruption on April 14th suggesting it could be several more weeks before the next major eruption occurs. On May 14th, a new webcam was installed at Biscuit Basin to track activity at Black Diamond Pool, the site of last summer's hydrothermal vent. The camera uploads still images every 15 minutes to https colon slash slash www.usgs.gov slash media slash webcams slash biscuit dash basin dash webcam and video is recorded on the site for later download if needed. Analysis of the still images showed changes in the pool on the evening of May 31st and the downloaded video captured a small eruption. This is the first eruption from Black Diamond Pool captured on video since the hydrothermal vent on July 23, 2024, although there is evidence from other monitoring data and some eyewitnesses that sporadic eruptions have occurred several times since the July 2024 event. During May, scientists at the Yellowstone Volcano Observatory installed semi-permanent GPS stations in the area to track surface deformation. These installed each strengthen the ongoing GPS network, and they are reinstalled in the fall before they are buried by snow. Maintenance of the geophysical and temperature monitoring stations has also been completed, and the new webcam has been installed at Biscuit Basin. Additional work expected to produce a new seismic-slash-acoustic-slash-GPS station in the Biscuit Basin is planned for June. During May 2025, the University of Utah Seismograph Station, which is responsible for the operation and analysis of the Yellowstone Seismic Network, detected 119 earthquakes in the Yellowstone National Park area. The largest event that month was a magnitude 2.7 micro-earthquake, located about 7 miles north of Lake in Yellowstone National Park, on May 26 at 6.39 p.m. Mountain Daylight Saving Time.